but this is the kind of road that I have to walk on. It's like complete kutche. It's puddle. The road walked all the way from Patong Beach to Bangla Market and he was scouting around. just landed we were expecting a pickup from our hotel and in someone who was supposed to come and pick us up isn't here so we are waiting for him in the meantime we got our visa approved um, it was a visa on arrival so we already had our visa immigration done we just had to get that stamp that was done then we got our sim um, temperature right now as of today in Phuket is 29 degrees Celsius. It is quite stuffy and humid outside. Weather in the past few days uh, leading up to our arrival has not been great. Uh, few days before our arrival, we could get had a huge accident, which was the greatest in like the past uh, 20 years. Uh, even today, there was a heavy downpour on our way from the airport to the hotel. So, weather today isn't permitting us to do whatever we had thought of in mind. Hopefully, if the weather clears, we will be able to go to the Patong market, which is on the road that we just seen and towards the night if the weather becomes better we will go and explore the night market so we finally braved the rain and we got out of our hotel and we started walking towards the indian restaurant but this is the kind of road that i have to walk on it's like complete kutche it's puddle the road is submerged and nobody knows where they're walking so i think we're going back to the hotel and it's for sure some other alternative for now. We came back to the hotel and we got and we're getting food over here. Um, we ordered Thai green curry. This is my first time eating Thailand's Thai green curry and wait, first impression. Oh, <coughs> It's mighty spicy. Um, oh my god. But it's got a lot of vegetables. It's very, very predominantly is uh, eggplant or brinjal. Uses bok choy, uh, carrots, beans, and uh, edamame, which is uh, avre kado. So, yeah, so. I'm really excited to try this and this is my lunch for today. Hello from Patong Beach. Look at this beauty right behind me and I'm so excited to like go play in the water. How do you like your first few hours in Thailand and how do you like it here in Phuket? Yeah, it's been rainy the whole day and now we have come to a Later. It's day one of our vacation. After we spent about two hours at the beach, we went and walked around uh, Bangla Market, which is where a lot of counterfeit items are available. But they were quoting such a huge price, it didn't make sense to buy it. And no matter how much I bargained, they were not willing to reduce their prices. So I just decided to leave it for another day somebody was missing uh, curd yogurt so guess who went and bought yogurt he got flavored yogurt from 7-eleven um, it's a supermarket chain here think of it like food world in Bangalore next morning good morning this is day two from Phuket and we are off to our coffee fee trip uh, so we've just packed our bags it's a day long trip at the beach there'll be a there'll be someone who'll come uh, come and pick us up from our hotel here and take us all the way to the beach and then drop us back the plan for the day is just enjoy Kofi Fee beach uh, the island itself 
and then towards the evening we've got our Simon Cabaret uh, show lined up we'll be watching that as well so let's go Watching a cabaret show, what what are your expectations from it? So far so good. There were two uh, preliminary showcases, so they all seem fine. So yeah, looking forward to it. Do you have any preconceived notions about it? No. No. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Was immense talent and it was a nice uh, time. Would you recommend it to anybody who comes to Phuket or Thailand next? Yeah, sure. Why not? Yeah. Good morning. This is day two in Phuket, and we are just checking out of our hotel. We have a ferry ride to Krabi and the guy who's supposed to pick us up is going to meet us at the lobby. Oh, no. 